It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from United Gypsies Brewery in Finland. And this is their Solven Circa, what looks to be an IPA at 5.5% ABV. It's in a 330 milliliter can. It's Finnish, Finland craft beer. And it was sent by the wonderful Buddy Weizen. Buddy Weizen, thank you very much, Buddy, for sending the beer all the way from, from Sweden. Uh, Sweden, Finland even. What's the matter with me today? Um, to be honest with you, I'm not quite sure what style of beer this is. It's a bit of a gamble. It's a bit of a... I mean, I didn't want to go on untapped or rape beer. Um, I wanted to... Because I can't understand the language, of course, and there's no English on here. I wanted to go into this beer review blind and give you what I think and what I feel about this beer, what what I, what I, style I think it is. So without further ado, let's get this beer out. Oh, blood in my neck. Oh. Now what am I going to do? I'm gonna smash the... I had to smash the top in with the end of my teaspoon. Here we go then. Every now and again we get a malfunction with a can. We've all had it from our cans of Pepsi or our cans of Coke, haven't we? It's just one of those things in life you just got to get yourself over. Um, Move on, adapt, smash the top in. <laughs> we got a one finger white head. Uh, good levels of carbonation on this beer, slow moving carbonation. It's a hazy amber colored beer. Let's get the aroma on the beer then. It looks nice as you roll the beer around in the glass. It's very nice. Hmm, so let's make our first decision then. Just by the nose alone, what style of beer do I think this is? I think it's a tad smoky, you know. It's got a little bit of kind of ranch malt or smoke malt in here. And then that goes over to being quite a hoppy finish on the back end. I mean, I got the beer out of the fridge about 10, 15 minutes ago, so it does feel cold still. Maybe I should have got it out of the fridge a little bit earlier. So maybe if we, we cradle the beer a bit, we warm the beer up a little bit, we'll get a little bit more of an aroma and a taste off it. But the aroma so far is, is a kind of a, like a smoked golden ale with some hops in it. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Mmm. It's really interesting because it has a touch of smoke. It has a touch of smoke, but I'm quite undecided as to what style of beer this is. You can feel the carbonation hissing and fizzing and pushing the beer on the inside of the mouth. It's definitely a smoked beer, without without a shadow of a doubt. Well, what I once said when I was. Uh, very, very inebriated on the channel, uh, without a shadow of a do. That was part of the um, man versus beer evening, where we tried to drink ten duvels. <laughs> without further ado. Five 
5.5% ABV is drinking very, very well. Um, it's a combination of a couple of... It's, it, it's a good sweetness to begin with. It's a good bitterness on the back end. It's a little touchy, smoky, little bit of smokiness in the middle. On the back end is spicy and peppery. It's hoppy, the hop flavours. I think it's more of a traditional hop from maybe Germany or Belgium, Czech Republic. It, it, it's not throwing like American hop flavours at me. It's not throwing New Zealand hop flavours at me. And it's nothing to do with the beer being slightly chilled because... Well, it's been opened. I've had it on the counter for 15 minutes and it's been open for six minutes. It would have warmed up by now. Ooh, pardon me. It's got good lacing on the glass as you rock the beer back and forth. All looks very good. The quality of the beer looks absolutely terrific. I'm just not 100% sure on the style and um, I feel like I'm being backed up in a corner here a little bit because I should know. Somebody who's drunk 7,000 beers, I really should know what style of beer this is. Um, I'm not going to say full on raunch beer because it's just not smoky enough. It, it's probably just a, a good old fashioned kind of Finland herbal kind of smoky beer. It's it's a little spicy and peppery. There's a little bit of pine needle. There's a little bit of citrus going on. But you get the breadiness from the malt, the biscuitiness from the malt. So it's quite balanced between the hops and the malt. The, the malt is sweet over here. And then you have the hops over here, which is... Bitter. Wow, it's a it's a tough one. It's a real tough one. But I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna put my It's not really sour in any way. I'm just gonna say it's a a slightly smoked rather traditional ale from Finland, a premium ale from Finland. It's definitely not a hopped up IPA, it's definitely not a gozer or a sour. It's definitely got a bit of smoke, smokiness going through. So yeah, a traditional, more of a traditional beer then from, from Finland. Let's rate it. Let's rate it. I like it. I like it. It's different, it's, it's challenging. I like the fact that that beer has challenged me massively. Um, I like it enough to give it an 8 out of 10. It's an 8 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.